You've been dumped. Boom. That's it. Your world has shattered. I've been there. You've been there. And guys, it sucks. I got dumped by George Michael when I was 12. I was in love. I was going to marry him. Who knew? Anyway, the fact is, the hardest thing sometimes people come to me with is, how do I tell somebody I no longer want to be with them? Now, I'm a real advocate in that if somebody doesn't want to be with you, then we have to let go because it's not healthy to hold on. But it's also important that we balance it in a way that's, that's kind and necessary and validates that person and your experience at the same time because we have a right not to be with people that we don't want to be with and also it's important that we take a healthy approach as well so if you want some tips on ending a relationship in a way that's balanced and fair and kind I always go back to my go-to the feedback sandwich you say something nice about that person because you were in a relationship with that person so there were plenty of nice things about them that initially attracted you to them and then you give them a bit of the meat the reasons why in a gentle way in an honest way but not to scar them for life so just be mindful yeah and then you end it with saying something nice again so they're left with something nice so you've put your feedback into a sandwich really for them to take away and to dwell upon and actually to process and take some meaning from and that would be far kinder than the let's never call them or text them or explain again because that leaves a person in the dark and to be left in the dark can be really traumatic so be kind be fair and make sure you give them that feedback in a sandwich <laughs>